Hello, Sopranos, and I do mean Sopranos plural, in that I am talking to both the Soprano Sopranos as well as the Mezzo Sopranos. This singing warm-up is in D, as in Delta, major. And as such, with the patterns being what they're going to be, and for how I am restricted key-wise being only in D, the challenges were going to be the same regardless uh, of mezzo or soprano. Given the considerations of range and registration event, the patterns were going to fall in the same places. And so I thought rather than split it up into two videos, we would include both of the fox, F-A-C-H, plural with an S, here. I'm going to go through the modes of the D major scale. I'm going to go through some pentatonic scale exercise. I have a really cool add a note exercise as well which involves a little bit of call and response. You'll have to listen to me do the vowel patterns. I'll be singing them an octave lower than you, and you can take it from there. You will be singing in unison with the piano. To start with, you can start here.
pentatonix. E I hope that helps. Relative pitch, the ability to hear the relationship between pitches. I did, did a bit of reading and there's some thought around the idea that the way that we normally vocalize where we're moving chromatically up and down and all over the place is not necessarily the best way to go about developing relative pitch. And so it was my thought to incorporate these in on a regular basis in the hopes of helping vocalists continue to work on relative pitch to just increase their overall hearing acuity as it relates to intonation and placement of pitches in the, give, in the scale, as it were, this being D major. So if you've got a piece that you're working on in D, you can warm up in D here on this particular exercise. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Jeff. Take really good care of your voices. Enjoy singing. Hopefully we'll see you again. Bye.